Alright, check it out. This is a penny. This is a battery made out of pennies. And we're getting point. 926 volts. All right, Mr. G, what's up? This is more than a one minute video. We're doing penny batteries today. So what am I talking about? All right, so check this out, right? Okay, inside of a penny, some of them are made out of zinc. Zoom in right here. Okay, take a look. The center is zinc, so it's just copper plated. Now this old penny from 1980, this one's got copper. All right, take a look, all copper inside. Right now, I can use that to my advantage. All right, so let's go over here. We're gonna do an experiment. All right, oh, <laughs> okay. the cameraman was backing up. All right, there you go. Okay, so pennies, uh, sorry, batteries are basically two different metals, all right? So now what we do here is we take, we take a penny, right? And do the overview now. Oh, this way, yeah. And you scrape off one side. Now I already pre-scraped it off. Okay, take a look. You see you got yourself some silver there. That's, that's the zinc, all right? And then you take a piece of cardboard that you cut to the same size and you could use vinegar or you could use salt water, okay? Either one works. Dip it in there, probably refresh it a little, okay? Put it on, the, on there, then take the copper. Now you should have voltage. There, it's negative because I went the wrong way. That's okay. There you go. Almost 0.9 volts. Right now, to prove to you that it's not coming out of anything here, I'll put this aside and I'll just test one individually. By the way, that's millivolts now. So it's just jumping around. There's nothing connected. Okay. And if you check the other one, it's just jumping around. Okay. But when you put two dissimilar metals, the zinc and the copper, through an electrolyte, you will get 0.9, sometimes 0.8, between 0.7 and 0.9. Okay, now, all right. Now let's say you stack these together, you could get higher voltage, that would be series, and the idea is you could light an LED. So that was a super quick way to do it. But I just want to give you a, like one or two more minutes to show you how I got there. So take a look. You take a penny that's uh, younger than um, 1982, okay? You take sandpaper and you sand off, literally just sand off one side. The tail side is the easiest side to do, okay? All right, once it's sanded off, you'll have all your zinc. All right, I'm just going to show it in the video there. Then you take your scissor and you go ahead and cut like a circle all the way around. And then you'll end up with this right here. Okay, put them together and you'll get it. And then you can stack these up. Now I'm using vinegar, but you could use salt. And just to show you how the voltmeter works, you click it over to volts. This one does AC or DC. This is a nine volt battery that's that I already know is close to dead, but if you just check, you just check it. This is 1.9. This is basically a dead battery. Okay, uh, but that's basically how it works. All right, I'm Mr. G. That was intro to penny batteries. See you later.